Jim, what did you see from Dylan Bundy tonight? I thought I saw a tenacious uh, performance. You know, not his best stuff, and you know, you could see he was a little bit out of uh, whack. I mean, he had good velocity. Actually, uh, after um, the Orioles really didn't play that well defensively behind him, he got up to 96 miles per hour and made some good pitches. Now this gets him out of the first inning. Otherwise, they might have scored three runs. You know, he went to the slider. You know, he was able, as uh, Welly T. Castillo said it in the interview, pitch inside a little bit more. So again, he, you know, these, these guys are swinging the bat well. Uh, you know, I, I, the world knows now that Matt Davidson can hit the fastball. He launched his third home run of the series, the right center field. We get another base hit. So I thought he adjusted after seeing uh, the White Sox hit over the first uh, two games. And, you know, again, you know, it's great. You know, all you got to do is look a couple of booths down. Steve Stone won 25 games uh, and won a Cy Young. And he just say, when I pitch, great. We won. And when I pitch so-so, we won. And, that, and this was one of those kind of games. And that's what you want. And the Orioles certainly needed that. Jimmy, you know, after the grand slam by Castillo, it seems, I was telling Tom, it seemed like uh, all of a sudden all the offensive players, Adam Jones in particular, along with Mancini, the short, the quick swings, using all the field, trying to go the opposite way, Adam Jones get a run in. The offense changed. Did you see the same thing I saw? Oh, I did. <laughs> and, you know, they had a lot of, I mean, you know, it's funny, you know, when Wellington and Castillo hits the, uh, the grand slam, who walked in front of them? Scope. How often does Jonathan uh, Scope walk? Not very often. So he had a couple of hits and maybe, uh, you know, Gonzalez being careful. Uh, you know, Mancini had another good night. J.J. Hardy hit the ball hard a couple of times. I mean, you know, one for a double over uh, Cabrera's head. Then he lined out to Cabrera. So, you know, again, you know, and Jonesy infield in, took a fastball that he knew he could hit the right field, kind of what you work on in batting practice when you don't overspring. And he shot it into right field. So a lot of quality at bats. And, uh, again, it's night. You know, it's not like they didn't score runs on Monday night. They just gave up 10. They scored seven. Last night they had all kinds of opportunities and maybe didn't kind of make the adjustments that you talked about. So much better offensive night. Uh, you know, you give up six runs, but you score 10 and you go home. But not for long. Put the head on the pillow and then get back here and try to uh, even up the series at uh, two games apiece tomorrow. By the time you get to the hotel, it'll be time to come back to the ballpark. I think they closed the hotel. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jim.